China's civil aviation industry continues to decline due to the effects of pandemic lockdowns, rising oil prices, and the devaluation of the renminbi or yuan. On January 30th, China Southern Airlines, China Eastern Airlines, and Air China released their latest performance reports. Data shows that the net losses of these three major airlines exceeded 4.4 billion dollars, or 30 billion yuan each, in 2022. According to official data from the Civil Aviation Administration, in 2022, total civil aviation revenue was 59.93 billion ton kilometers, and passenger traffic was 250 million. China Southern Airlines estimated that the net loss attributable to shareholders of listed companies was 4.45 to 4.9 billion dollars in 2022. The company's capacity input decreased by 28.1 percent year over year and 55.3 percent compared to 2019 data. Meanwhile, revenue per passenger kilometers decreased by 33.0 percent year over year and 64.2 percent compared to 2019 data. China Eastern Airlines estimated the 2022 net loss attributable to shareholders of listed companies was from 5.4 to 5.77 billion dollars. Air China's net loss during the same period was 5.5 to 5.9 billion dollars. Meanwhile, 2021 data showed Air China, China Eastern Airlines, and China Southern Airlines annual net losses totaled only 1.8 to 2.5 billion dollars. The net loss of the three companies in 2022 totaled 16.5 billion dollars maximum. In addition, China Southern Airlines also announced they applied for voluntary delisting of the company's depository shares from the New York Stock Exchange on the same day. According to Sina Finance, the reasons for the loss are roughly the same as those for the first three quarters of last year. The three main factors listed are falling demand, high oil prices, and the yuan depreciation. Air China's representative said passenger travel demand was low due to the pandemic's continued impact last year. As a result, the company's main base markets suffered, especially Beijing. This is where the company's capacity investment and total turnover fell to their lowest levels since the pandemic broke out. Other unfavorable factors, such as high oil prices and exchange rate fluctuations, have challenged the company's operations more. In addition, investment enterprises related to central business have also been seriously affected. In addition to the three companies above, Shanghai International Airport's net profit attributable to shareholders last year was estimated from 420 to 442 million dollars. In 2021, the company's net loss attributable to shareholders was 233 million dollars.